Students from the University of South Florida gathered with members of the community to be a part of the excitement of the 2012 election. International news outlet BBC Radio 5 Live held a special elections results program broadcasting from the Marshall Student Center Amphitheater. And if that exit poll is for a bomb, he probably wins the White House, so we'll keep an eye on that. Uh, hello there, hello again audience. A panel of representatives from the Tampa Bay community, as well as USF students, spoke with correspondent Richard Bacon about the climate of this year's presidential election. Students were busy with social media, checking into the event with Foursquare and enjoying prizes. Blue football, some beads, touchy rolls. Looks like American because, of course, it's election night, so <laughs> it's got to be patriotic colors. A common theme among many of the first-time voters was education. Uh, first off was education, studying here at USF. I want to stay here. and. My, my dad's a Marine, he's getting ready to retire next year, and my mom's not working, and I, I had some struggles with financial aid, actually, and I just, um, I, see, I, I see Obama's plan helping me out more with education. A patriotic Rocky posed for photos and celebrated the election excitement. Other national and international TV news organizations joined the election night watch party to capture the spirit of the election. So tonight we have the uh, election results watch party held by student government, Omega Phi Beta, Delta Sigma Theta, and NAACP. And as you can see, we have a phenomenal turnout. Um, you know, all of our organizations, we just wanted to get together and make sure that we uh, had, a, had a safe environment, an inclusive environment for students to come out, celebrate the results, be heard, and make sure that uh, they hear what's going on on campus and hear what's going on in, throughout the nation. The crowd anxiously awaited the results Tuesday evening, and as the numbers started rolling in, students reacted to the results from local and national races. I think it's a lot of fun. We just had the cheerleaders out cheering for us, saying good job you, congrats on voting, and everybody's here. It's such a big event, and I feel, just feel like everybody is so involved. The excitement built as the results poured in, and students stayed engaged with live broadcasts well into the night, waiting to see if their candidate would be victorious. All of us, we all just turned 18, everybody I graduated with, and we're all going to school and we need somebody who's going to represent us that's hearing our voices.